These heroes will never be defaced. Their legacy will never, ever be destroyed. The president lashed out at protesters seeking to remove controversial historical figures from their place on pedestals. Our nation is witnessing a merciless campaign to wipe out our history, to fame our heroes, erase our values, and indoctrinate our children. Mr. Trump announced a new executive order creating a national garden to feature statues of American heroes. We are the country of Andrew Jackson, Ulysses S. Grant, and Frederick Douglass. At the event, there was little space for social distancing. Complimentary masks, five to a package. Organizers offered masks, but few in the crowd put them on. And now coronavirus has entered the president's family circle. 57,000, sorry, new infections. The U.S. president promised a tremendous celebration to mark Independence Day. Positioned under the watchful gaze of some of the country's most influential leaders, Trump linked his presidency to defending their legacy. I am here as your president to proclaim before the country and before the world, this monument will never be desecrated. These heroes will never be defaced. Their legacy will never, ever be destroyed. Their achievements will never be forgotten. And Mount Rushmore will stand forever as an eternal tribute to our forefathers and to our freedom. The trip to South Dakota came amid heightened racial tensions, a time of national reckoning over the symbolism of monuments with ties to slavery. There is a growing danger to face our most sacred memorials and unleash a wave of violence.